All right, what is up you guys? Digger Dan here, coming at you with another video. This time, picking back up with Totally Accurate Battle Simulator, or better known as Tabs. Um, so far, we got through the Introduction Campaign, the Adventure Campaign, the Challenge Campaign, and now we're halfway through the Dynasty Campaign. Um, so, without further ado, let's, uh, let's jump right into it. Um... So we have a single knight with healers, and we can, ooh, interesting. So they did change some stuff since the last time I've played. Legacy, interesting, but we can't play any of these. Secret, what? Interesting. Cool, I don't know how to get rid of these now. Maybe shift click. I don't know, it doesn't matter. We can only use dynasty. Um, right now, but if you've never seen any tabs gameplay before if you've never watched my previous videos first I suggest going back and watching those <laughs> um, but if you uh, Are still watching and you're still familiar or still curious um, Basically it, it's we're the red side. And we're just trying to defeat the blue side um, And we're only given a certain allowance and we can only in right now it's 1200 gold or value of, or whatever and um, different units have different values um, all right so something with a big old shield I think I'm just gonna projectiles aren't gonna be the best let's actually get rid of one of these so we need a couple of samurai let's get more of an arc going um, but we're gonna try it and find out because really, I just need him to like fly off or up. Maybe not up, but fly off would be better. Yeah, he's still alive, so that's not good. All right, our samurai are still alive, though, so that's good. And we won. Awesome. So easy peasy. All right, it looks like we can still only do dynasty. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, I mean, makes sense for in the dynasty campaign. Um, some notes and arrows. Looks looks like it's more loot boys. Well, what are these guys again? They are Renaissance. No, they're not Renaissance. Are they? Medieval. They're medieval. That's what it is. So yeah, bard and then archers, just straight up. Interesting. Okay. So. Let's see what we can do. Samurai with the arrows are probably going to get chopped up pretty good. Let's try monks because I, th I think they can deflect arrows. I'm not 100% sure, but I believe they can. But it kind of helps with the, uh, the big pillar right there too. Kind of deflecting a lot of the arrows. Alright, our own archers are... Well, two of them are doing more than these monks are. All right, monk got one of them. Yeah, I guess our monks really are just distractions. And these stupid bards, they just run off. So really just got to scare them off. Hopefully he'll just die. Without our, my guys just dying, trying to get to, down to him. Yeah, there you go. Yeet. Bye. No, he's still alive somehow. There he goes. That's wild. He's like, yeah, he was barely still alive. I don't know if he drowned or he was just out of map range or what, but I'll take it. Ooh, so now we have some catapults. All right. We have a monkey king who is just going to go in there and mess stuff up, hopefully. Or, or not. <laughs> um, so let's get rid of monkey king. That's right, I can't rotate. Um, not until we place. Hmm. <laughs> I think I need to do like a wide spread. Just kind of have them randomly out there. Yeah. But they need to be closer. Or my ninjas do. Because now they're going to get messed up. Yeah. No bueno. 
Um, well, actually, let's just try archers. Let's see if the archers can get to them before they mess them up. Although, it doesn't really do much damage until it explodes. So there's one. That's progress. Ooh. That pillar did work for us. Okay, cool. Archers are usually the way to go. Range. Range out beats range. Oh, not what I meant to do. So now we have knights and their squires. So it's just exactly what it is. Three knights and a handful of squires. Um, let's do a dragon on each side. Because dragons are amazing. Although the dragons will probably go for the middle. So that might not work out that well. But we'll have Monkey King mess up the knights. There we go, Monkey King. Alright, so Dragon made short work of the squires. The other Dragon made short work of the other squires. Monkey King, I, oh, he's still alive somehow. These guys are just flying. I don't, okay, sure. Um, there we go. That was easier than I thought it should have been. But Alright, I will take it. Moving on. Alright, Notes and Arrows of Revenge. Oh, and Arrow's Revenge. So it's just, yeah, no, it's, okay. Got it. So watch this. We're just going to do a line of archers. Enough to make my CPU chug down to not very much. Bye. I think it's stupid that they all went for the same, same guy. But it's all good. They're making progress. Although they have more bodies than we do. So hopefully, my archers spread out a little more. Now nah, we lost. Okay. So can I do... Alright, let's get rid of all these archers. I'm still going to do a handful, like, a majority archers. But I feel like I need more bodies in front. And then more, like, clustered up. And then just an overarching arc, I guess. Because Ho hopefully that'll mean... No, they're still going for the just the two. Okay. Because I was hoping that would maybe mean they would target differently, but it's all good. Also, the samurai can deflect arrows. I was... Okay. Good to know. So samurai are a good call. I think we just need more of them. Because, yeah... They're messing up our archers pretty good. Although, we got their catapults. So now it's really just a handful of ours against two of theirs. Just explode. Meow. Let's see his stupid face. Yeah, there you go. You're done. You're done. Alright, cool. Alright, so now it's kings and bows. So three kings. Interesting. Against a handful of archers. So we'll do... King v. King. We really just need one Monkey King, I feel like. And then we'll do a little handful of Samurai. We've got to kind of go on the outside so we'll target the archers. And then we'll back up our King with just a butt ton of archers of our own. Alright, so Samurai are making short work of the archers, which is awesome. Although the kings made short work of our monkey king, so that's not good. But hopefully these uh These archers will do some damage. Although it doesn't help if we hit our own archers. Samurai aren't doing too much. Or really a whole lot of anything actually. I'm going to be disappointed if we don't get a single king down. But that's the way it's looking. Yeah, he missed. Okay. So let's redo. I'm going to keep the samurai the way they're doing it. I think I want to do... What is A hawacha on each side. Do a little handful of these guys. And maybe... Well, not a couple of monks, but we'll do a couple of these. Bam. Hopefully that's good because it's a perfect amount of... There we go. Two kings done. That's that's the magic. Just need a machine gun arrow to the face. 
That'll get you every time. That's yeah, cool. I guess I never actually like watched it go in slow mo, or not in slow mo, but after it's done. But that's cool. Cool, 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 cool. Moving on. All right, so two formations. So now it looks like it's ancient stuff, so like phalanx and archers, snake archers. Snake archers are annoying. Um, but these guys are kind of overpowered and will make definite short work. Um, but also samurai in front, kind of deflect some of the arrows, hopefully. Although they, have, they do have shields. Did not really think about that. It's gonna take them a minute to uh, to reload there. Yeah, if they had faster reload time, these guys would be a lot more useful. So actually, what I think I should do is just focus on one formation. We'll come back a little farther. I'll do more archers. Kind of in harder to reach areas. Because these fireworks are, even with shields, they're still useful against them. Um, and a dragon. Do a dragon a little farther back. Hawacha back here. Hopefully it doesn't kill the dragon. Guess we'll find out. And then we'll do some samurai off to the side. Okay, so it did kill our own dragon. Great. The dragon does seem more effective than the machine gun arrows. These two archers are doing a little bit of work, not much. This one looks like he's having issues. I don't know how he ended up up there. I thought I put him down on the platform, but I guess not. This is definitely a slower battle now. Yeah, snake archers, I think, are doing a little more than my archers. Dang it, now it's just... Okay, two on one now. Yeah. Oh, well. So the dragon actually costs less. So let's do dragon over here. Because the breath down there is just... is just stupid overpowered. And we'll have some guys over here. I don't know, we'll have one archer up there just just because we can. Alright, this dragon's just messed up. Not doing much. But this one over here is doing some work. There we go. Dragons are the way to go. Just like we learned last episode. Dragons are OP. Alright, Minotaur delivery. Alright, let's do the same thing. Although, I pro not, not up there. Although, with the Minotaurs, I probably need some bodies in front. Just to deflect. But I think close to the mouth, just so it gives maybe the, the dragon uh, a chance to shoot it overhead of the, of the samurai's heads. But I guess we'll find out. And then the rest can just be ninjas. I guess. I don't feel like I utilize ninjas enough. And then just a single, single little archer. Oh, that's hilarious. They went up for the ninjas, the minotaurs. That's, that's wild, actually. <laughs> but it's all good. Fire breath is overpowered. All right, so now Zeus and other folks. Looks like they're all back here. Okay, so maybe this is where the range comes into play. Um, but we'll find out. The rest I'll just put ninjas over there and see what happens. Yeah, so they do have shields. But my range, hopefully, kind of counter that. Yep, their shields are... And he has chain lightning, okay. So that took care of the ninjas really quickly. All right, I do think the Hawacha is the way to go. I think I just need, I think I just need to go full range. 
and just see what happens. Get some firework arrows on these shields, make them spin around, dance. And then they can just focus on Zeus. And then hopefully he can't shoot very accurately, because he's getting messed up. There we go. Range all the way, baby. Alright, so now we have Ballista. Another new map setting. Awesome. Alright, so Ballista. Alright, so I think... Dragon. Dragon. Although these guys are probably going to mess up the dragons pretty good. So we'll put some ranged artillery of our own. And then just spam some infantry. There we go. Let's just see what happens. Alright, so the middle got messed up pretty good. Looks like we killed our own dragon. So that was not ideal. Now we just need to target the ballista. There we go. Two down. Still got a decent amount of infantry. Well, one infantry. And then two. Well, three dragon carriers. But then our infantry just outperforms their infantry. Love it. Alright, Zeus Revenge. They have more range. We have more money. And they have more shields. Okay. So again, just mess them up get some on each end and then just mess them up with some arrows there we go now it's all about who can shoot who faster really Zeus are getting messed up a shield is in the action somehow. Kawacha or Hawacha, whatever it's called, doing work. Looks like both Zeus's are out. Nice. Now it's just uh, little Timmy over here, just trying to survive against his onslaught of range, and he couldn't do it. Poor little Timmy. All right, compact formation. Ooh, and they have shields. Okay. So let's do two dragons. Bam, bam. And then a Kawacha back here, just for good measure. And then we'll just do layers and layers of arrows. That's just been my... Oh, I have the Berserk that... Do that, I forgot about that. And this is slowing down my CPU like crazy. So he's getting caught on the dragon. Hopefully he can stay that way. Oh, he missed. It's really... Oh, just the two. Reload, reload, reload. Do it. Oh. We won. We won by the skin of our teeth. Look at that. He was right in your face. So it's like it was impossible to miss. I'm really surprised that that worked. But range... I'm telling you, range. Range is superior. Alright, the Great Leap. So these are the Leapers. And these are the Archers. So what I need to do is have a couple sacrificial guys at the launch at. And then just wreck their day. And then we'll have well, they're ice archers. We'll see which are more effective. Them or us. Okay, so launching. I didn't have big enough of a sacrifice squad. And we just got we just got messed the F up. Alright, good to know. So let's clear it. Hmm. I don't know, I think dragons again. Dragons are just the way to go. Ooh, what the? Is that a big one? I was so confused. What the heck? What the? How the heck did that happen? I deleted them? Why would I delete them? I 
How the heck did that happen? That was wild. Maybe he was just on top of the other's head somehow? I don't know. Um, but we're gonna have six this time. Maybe a little more of a a meat shield. Oh, see, there he goes. Is he bigger or no? I don't think he is. He's just weirdly on a hill or something. I don't know. Alright, we haven't used many ninjas. So let's try to get them going. Let's see what what magic they can make happen. And then the rest, I guess, will just be archers. Because I don't know what else to do. Alright. So meat shield didn't really work out all that well. Although ninjas are maybe doing some work. Samurai deflecting arrows. So more samurai is definitely the plan. Although once they don't deflect it, then they get frozen. And they just get shot up. Alright, so I think if we can just outlast them. Yeah, there we go. For a second there, I got worried. But cool. That works out. I feel like it was a similar... Uh-oh. I feel like it was a similar tactic to the first try, but it worked out. Alright, so these are stupid launchers. That'll be really annoying. I don't think over... Well, maybe. I was going to say, maybe, I don't think overwhelming range is going to do it this time. Kind of give something to Valkyrie to pounce on. And let the monkeys mess them up. And I think just ninjas. And then just more samurai. There we go. Let's see what happens. Alright, Dragon got dispatched way too quickly. I will not be using him next time. Maybe the Kawacha. Or Hoacha. I, I, I'm dumb. I don't know how to pronounce it. Looks like Monkey King putting in some work. I only have one Monkey King though. And now I have no Monkey King. Alright, so get rid of you. Get rid of you. And you. And you. I'll put you back here. Just so you're not sacrificed immediately. There you go. Although you didn't really hit anything, so good job. Alright, there you go. You got one. Alright, and the Monkey Kings. There you go. There you go. So I guess that first volley did do some work. Nice. Good job. Okay, so Viking army. Looks like we have pouncers on each side. Jarls, I think is what they are. And then we have some ships. Awesome. So for the pouncers, naturally we need to do samurai. Naturally. Actually, what we can do is put them way back here. Dispatch the pouncers almost immediately. Or quicker. And then... Because they'll pounce, they'll pounce. Maybe another line. Just in case they bust through the first line immediately. Um, and the rest, I just keep saying, are going to be these firework archers. You let them pounce. They pounce a little too aggressively. Unfortunately. Oh. Who has the magic crap? Is that the Jarls? Yeah, I have to reset there. Um, hmm. Maybe I have to set these guys a little further up front. Because I think they can do it. Now they just immediately go to the back. Okay. So let's just set these guys farther back. Because I really want this to be the winning strategy. I just don't know if it's going to be. There you go. Let them get more fire breath on them. Ooh. Alright, so left side's definitely doing better than the right side. Hopefully our, our archers start focusing on this Jarl. There you go. It's just the Jarl and the one paddle boy. Or oarsman. Oh, we have... Alright, Samurai basically sacrificed himself. I don't know what the heck our dragon's doing. If he could turn around and... Uh, light this Yarl up, that'd be nice. 
Bye. We. When you turn into a firework, that's how you know you uh you messed up. He done messed up, boy. All right, cool. That was the Dynasty campaign. Thank you for playing through the Dynasty campaign, showing the new faction. Cool. Well, I think that's going to do it for this episode, guys. If you enjoyed this, please hit like down below. If you guys want to see more from me, Tigger Dan, please hit that subscribe button. Uh, don't forget to hit that bell notification icon as well. And if you guys want to do me a favor, um, please share this video or just my channel in general with your friends. Um, or at least one friend or one person you know. Um, it just help out a ton. Um, yeah. Appreciate you guys. Thank you again for watching. And I will catch you in the next episode. Ciao.